Welcome back to JSA TV, everyone, where we are coming to you live from the Expo Hall of Yada 2024. We're covering the latest stories, trends, and innovations from leaders across the digital infrastructure industry. And joining me now, we've got Lindsay Bruner with Clean Arc Data Centers. Thank you so much for being here. My pleasure. We're really excited to talk to you. Always love having uh, having uh, some of our team on. I know that you guys have been doing some really great work with us at JSA TV. And I hear from our team that you guys have had a pretty busy month or so, <laughs> a really big announcement had just went out. Um, can you share with us yes, what that was? Yes, yes. No, we had some we had some very exciting news that we were able to, to share just uh, this past month, and that is we've received a strategic investment from Snowhawk Partners um, that has allowed us to um, really advance a lot of uh, initiatives with the company, which was the second big announcement that came out in that press release. Mm -hmm. We have closed on our first piece of property in Virginia uh, that we look forward to developing as a data center campus. That is very, very exciting. It it's is. very much needed in Virginia very much. in that area as yeah. well. Okay. Any yeah. any other teasers you want to put out for us on that? So we're, we're really moving very firmly into the development phase now, and we're actually going to be having you know some interactions with the community later this month to talk more about the project and explain what it is that we're bringing, bringing to their community. Absolutely. Okay. Well, we'll stay tuned to yes. hear more on that yes. and see how that develops. Um, one of the things, of course, driving the need for services like what you're bringing to the table is AI, mm -hmm. artificial intelligence. It's driving up that demand and, you know, we just need the digital infrastructure out there. So the big question on everyone's mind, and it's on the homepage, if you go to the mm -hmm. Yada 2024 website, is how will digital infrastructure meet the demands of AI? So how would you answer that question? So there have been a lot of really great conversations and panels and, and you know, things happening here at, at Yada around that topic. And I think, you know, one of the big things is that we don't fully know exactly what AI is going to be and what it's going to require of the data center industry um, and how, th how things are going to change. So I think the, you know, how does digital infrastructure meet the demands? It's really by being flexible and innovative and responding to what's coming as opposed to, you know, trying to continue to apply legacy solutions to new technologies. Yeah. It's one of sort of our founding principles is we're, we're not bound by legacy. We're fully ready to meet the needs of the data center of the future. And so we're really excited about everything that's happening in the industry right now. Yeah. So what, what does that look like as much as you can tease for us at CleanArc? <laughs> what, what do you have coming down the pike? Well, you know, it means being uh, having a facility that's adaptive to different densities, mm -hmm. you know, that you can put multiple types of cooling, multiple energy power requirements within the same data hall and be able to be responsive to how those servers are, are you know, using energy and requiring cooling. Um, that, that type of innovation, I think, is really what the industry really needs to go to over the next several years. Um, we're also, obviously, we're very concerned with uh, clean grid, and you know, it's in our name. Um, and one of the things that we're really excited to offer customers is load following renewable energy that meets their energy requirements in addition to the utility power that we can bring. So those are all things that we're working on to support this data center campus and our future ones. Yeah, it's, it's definitely in innovative, but I mean, just as you said, mm -hmm. the same way got us here, but it's not necessarily right. going to get us there. Exactly. So, exactly. So we've got to keep thinking and innovating. Exactly. We're also going to need some really great people coming yes. into the industry. And that's something yeah. that's been a topic of mm -hmm. conversation for mm -hmm. quite some time now is we just have a shortage of people uh, absolutely coming uh, in. So yeah, yeah. No, there, there's, there's a lot of different opportunities to get involved in the data center industry and the, the needs for everyone from electricians to accountants is critical. Uh, as the industry grows and scales, we, we need all of those different roles to support the industry. So, yeah. yeah. What would you do, say to that next generation of up and comers or someone who maybe hasn't even considered this yeah. field? It's, um, I would say absolutely like learn more about what a data center is. They're, they're everywhere and the more, and they influence every single aspect of our modern life. So the more that you understand about what data centers are, what services they provide, and how you know they really fuel everything that we do on a day-to-day -day basis, I think that will help overcome some of the hurdles that we're seeing and how to uh, 
uh, you know, integrate data centers into communities that they're going into now. Yeah, it really is an exciting industry that yeah. we get to be a part of, isn't Absolutely. it? Absolutely, yes. Yeah. <laughs> well, Lindsay, where can people go to keep up with CleanArc and what you guys have coming up? Come, come see us at www.cleanarcdatacenters.com. Um, drop by our community event in, uh, in Virginia or say hi to any of us. There's several of us here at Yada and we'd love to talk more about Clean Arc and what we're doing. All right. Well, thank you very much. Thank you. Always that. appreciate hearing from, from the team at Clean Arc. And thanks to our viewers for tuning in. Stay curious and stay connected, everyone.